Hello everyone, this is John Hendrick, uh, and I'm trying a 5D chess game against my opponent, D-O-M, Dom. Um, and we're going to see how it goes. We're going to play two games. I'm going to mute myself on Discord, so it's going to be a quiet game of me self-pity and, and, wallow, and wallowing in my misery of how bad I play, but I'm going to try my best. This is probably this is my sixth league game, so I, I have some experience, and we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm going to mute myself now in the voice chat. Mm -hmm. Best, Best of luck. luck. Best of luck. Good luck to both. Uh -huh. um, mute. Okay. So it is my turn. Yes. Uh, Coach John, John is playing to his element. element. London, London system is at least a little bit more natural to him. Mm -hmm. Oh, Dom is in the voice chat. I'm going to play one of these guys in Raiders after this. It's an Evo. I'm gonna, I have to play Dom. If I can leave match against him. Nick, are you on Fracture from Earth to advance it? Uh, yes and no. It depends, it depends on, on it, it depends on Sudo. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, I guess, you know, Sudo is probably being advanced as well. So what you guys hear in the background is the people commenting about our match, so they're, they're excited. The problem I have is that I'm still not great in the middle game. Check this out, guys. Yeah. If I click on the bishop. Like the, the opening from all the other opening guys, but I played oh, you in the middle game. I mean, I, th I feel like, because I, I beat you in two games, and both of those ended in the middle game, and the ones that you beat me in the middle game. I could beat you in the middle game. Um, it depends. So th this is fun to listen to the players. I'm going for a cheaper, a cheaper. <clears throat> yeah, we're talking a bit, um, dry, I shouldn't say anything. Yeah. White is definitely an interesting variation. Yeah. Yeah. You can see where white doesn't do it. Just slow. Yeah. You can also just, uh, just play too often or something like that. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, he does it. Whoa. I'm going back in time. 
And I'm making a new timeline and going for the sacrifice. Don't try to say anything. He's <laughs> just stuck in the travel animation for a while. So the question is whether this will actually do something. It depends. It depends. Does Dom know how to. It depends if Dom knows how to defend against it. I think that Coach John should deaf him so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I should deaf it. I should deaf I will definitely, I will def. I will definitely. I don't know if he's already like turned the point down in Discord. I, I will definitely, I will definitely def it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, how do I. Right. There's a def. Okay, I def it. Okay. <laughs> okay, and then. Um, so. Oh, it's the, the the present is now over here. This is the present. So let's play a little. Let's go for a little check. Probably a check spice. Um, I'm actually gonna go for. Uh, I mean, let me go. For, I don't know if I should check first here with the knight or if I should play. Uh, if I should check with the knight or if I should play, um, I think checking with the knight is good. Let's just check the knight. his king back um i want to get if i move my bishop to f4 um kind of pins his knight because i could play bishop up so bishop f4 looks interesting um I'm gonna play. I don't know if it's too slow though. I'm gonna play Bishop F4 though. Okay, he's blocking that uh, diagonal. Both diagonals, that's a good job. Uh, okay. What does our bishop move look like? We can go to. Yeah, we can take the knight. Let me see. Let's just push the pawn up here. He's blocking the diagonal to hit towards his king, which is a very smart thing to do. I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna try to play. I'm gonna go for another check and stuff. Now we're caught up in the uh, in the present tense. So now he could take my bishop in this timeline. It looks like. Hmm. But I wonder if he has to watch out for my check. So he plays queen there in this timeline. Okay. Probably gonna take my bishop in this timeline. Hmm. Give me an exciting. It's getting really exciting. Oh, in that check, he's actually, um, oh, is it my turn? No, it's his turn. He actually wants to play, he has a secret motivation. He wants to play queen check on me. So this knight can go. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I can go there. This knight. Um, my bishop. Bishop can go. Not what. Yeah, and then this bishop's interesting. Hmm. Um. Check. Check. 
check. And then his king's in check. I don't know, checks you're usually good in this type of uh, game here. I'm going to develop my knight here. He's in check. Oh, he took it back? Okay. He has to, I guess. I didn't block his queen to b4 check. So that could be some trouble for me. Okay, he's playing. Uh, he put his queen over. I don't know why he brought his queen over there. Oh, I guess he wants to bring it out to attack me. That makes sense. I guess we have to take the knight. But this might be a mistake. Mm. Let's see here. What can we do? Hmm. This is a tricky one. Uh, this is a tricky one. Okay. Um I guess my rook doesn't want to be there. Hmm. He blocks the pawn, it's the only problem. Oh he can't do that because it puts his king in check? How is that? I didn't even see how that puts his king in check. Wait, he's going. What's he doing? <laughs> What's he doing? He he's thinking about putting his king on a different timeline to get out of check. Uh oh. He went. What did he do? The queen went all the way over there. Wait, I don't get what he did. That's so far in the past. That's what I did. Oh, he traveled his queen over. And he made a new timeline up here. Ah. So is that the new present? Oh, that's the new present. Okay. So he brought his queen over here and made a new present. And now I have to go in this timeline. So, he, so he's trying to attack me in this in this timeline. He's trying to attack me. So I should I should be safe. I should try to stay safe in this timeline. Um Let's try to block everything as much as possible. I guess it makes sense. Knight goes back. Okay. Uh, I think this is safe. I'm not sure. I'm attacking his queen. I don't know if I just opened myself up for big trouble. It's like we're. It looks like it's uh now it's complicated. There's um three timelines, and it's his turn. He's in check in this timeline. I'm attacking his queen in this one. Hmm. He's still in check though. I don't know how this um solved any of his problems. Hmm. Very interesting. So black's still thinking, that must be a good thing, right? That must be a good thing.
Mm. Oh, this queen is going all the way there. And what's it doing over there? He made a new timeline? Or what did he do? What did he do? What did he do? This queen's gone. Where'd it go? I'm so confused. It's my turn. He just moved his queen. Wait, let me zoom out to see what. Is it. Oh, he made a new timeline. Oh, he made a new presence. A new presence. He, oh, so, so here's another presence. Um, I think I'm just going to to go here and chase his queen. I think that's okay. His queen goes back. Now I don't know if my king's in, da in danger now, but I feel like I could castle just to be safe. I don't know if his... Hmm. Is he jumping over? Let's just let's just go check here. What's that sound? Is that a good sound? I'm checking him. Why'd the clock stop? What happened? I don't know what happened. Hold on. Let me let me go back to Discord. I think I, I might have won. Okay. I, 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 I don't know what happened. Is is the game over or something? Yeah, yeah. yeah, you got checked. Yeah. How do? How is it? Dom, you, Dom, you had made it one. Oh, uh, did I? Really? Yeah. Okay. You just, you just, you just didn't, didn't need to take, take the bishop with the knight. What? Uh, bishop with the knight? Bishop with the knight. You know the bishop that was checking, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 oh what, what, what? When I played bishop check, he should play just queen check, or what? What? No, he should have just played. Yeah. 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 That's what I was worried about. To get to the triangle, just wasn't looking at the the his queen. Yeah. Yeah. Also, Dom, can I ask about that opening? Uh, no, don't. Wait, wait. So if he plays, if he plays pawn g six. I'm gonna lose my queen there, right? Because I have to block the triangle. Uh, no, no, you could play, play the c pawn. Yeah. That's what I mean. I have to block with the c pawn, then he takes my queen. Oh. No, no, no. no, oh, he... no, no. If he if he did pawn to d, if he did pawn up, right, to block the bishop. Yeah. At that point, he just needed to move. Well, actually, yeah, Coach Sean could have preemptively moved the c pawn. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. I had to do. So, but I was worried. You could also do, could also do pawn e. But I was worried about if I after queen check, why couldn't he just play g6 at that point? Because my is my queen triagonally jumping over? Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah. So you, have you have an open, open triangle, triangle on the king, king and it's, it's basically, basically a soft mate. You're, you're winning, winning that position. position. That's, that's oh. usually why uh, you know you play openings like to prevent that big stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, so my yeah. queen sacrifice was a good idea. That's queen. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Uh, I would, I would say, say a little bit iffy. Uh, yeah. Like the exact yeah. movement you'd, you'd have, have to do is a bit weird. You, you have, have to play knight g4 instead of e4. Or sorry, knight uh, g5 instead of e5. Mm. Specifically because you could do another knight move that gets another check following that. Oh, knight g5 is, is, is better, oh, wait, huh? Oh, wait, yeah. did, you say the, did you say the queen sacrifice on f7? No, he, I guess he meant the following play. He meant the subsequent play. Yeah. yeah. So the queen's queen sacrifice on f7 on a bit no question. You should have played. You should have done that much much earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. He so didn't have to defend that at all. You, you sack on f7. Would have had force man if you had done it earlier. Oh, I oh I I had to sack on f7 way earlier, huh? Yeah. 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 Also, because what the turn that you went back to on f7 with the queen was already defended with the knight, Dom just had to play the the. Uh, D5, and then you didn't really have any triangles with your queen to, uh, to actually, like, stop anything. Yeah. If you do the queen stack from move 5, it's winning. 
but you did it a bit lighter than that. Oh, so it it's, it's kind of it iffy. Winning, but it wasn't as winning. So, yeah. so, so when I checked him on H with Bishop H five, that's it's there's two checks. There's two checks at the same time. Is that the problem? Uh, uh no. The bishop, bishop he, he could have just played pawn g six, and everything would have been fine for mm -hmm. him, and he would have just lost the bishop. But because he took with the knight, right? You were able to get a soft maybe. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. make and and see, I tried to do a fancy thing, thing with my knight, but I was uh, one, one square, square off. Yeah. And yeah. Able to yeah. And since he's had, I, since, I didn't really think it through. And since you're in check on two different timelines in the present tense, that's why it's game over. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's also game oh. over because there's no way to capture the queen. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Basically, he ran out of timelines to go back, and he couldn't capture the queen. Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. The queen was the important thing there. It was diagonally made. It was diagonally soft mating him. Okay, got it. Yeah. So the queen was the important one. Everything else was like supplementary that mm -hmm. helped your condition. That just helped your situation, basically. So, yeah. Okay, that was. But a good... the queen was the main threat. Well, that was a good game. I'm gonna. I'm gonna say goodbye to the YouTube people and uh, mm -hmm. goodbye. Please subscribe and hit the bell button.